Hi, this is Jack Duvall, CEO of Bantam Incorporated, a private investment office in New York. Today, I wanted to talk briefly about an interview uh, that I recently published uh, with Peter Harris. And this is a uh, continuation of the series that we're doing uh, for entrepreneurs and family-owned businesses. In this uh, series, I'm interviewing people that uh, are in this ecosystem of advising uh, entrepreneurs and family-owned businesses about either selling the business or taking in outside capital. Uh, now, Peter is a very interesting guy, very sharp, and he's a director at Axel Johnson, which is a uh, family, basically a family-owned conglomerate uh, that's based out of uh, Europe. And they have over uh, 3.4 billion in revenues, annual revenues uh, from a number of different operating companies uh, that they own. Um, so it's a very interesting perspective. What's different about Axel Johnson is that they take a, uh, what I would call a permanent capital approach to investing. So this is different from a typical private equity fund. There's no time constraint on their uh, investment. And in fact, they're not looking to sell, um, thus the permanent part of permanent capital. Uh, they do make sales occasionally, but that's uh, discussed in the transcript where a company is maybe uh, better off in other hands or the dynamics in the industry have changed uh, such that the company uh, could grow better somewhere else. Uh, but one of the things that, or I should say a couple of things that Peter said were interesting is um, he highlighted how Axel Johnson is uh, possibly a better uh, fit for some companies um, and some owners, uh, depending on what they're looking to do. And also how uh, when they uh, buy a company, it's not as good for the investment bankers because they're they're not going to have the the second transaction, that sale transaction, uh, because basically if they buy a company, they're going to hold on to it uh, for a long time. Could be 20 years, could be more. Um, the other thing Peter really talked about that struck me was the difference between thinking like an investor and thinking like an owner. And obviously at Axel Johnson, they're thinking like uh, owners because they want to own a company for forever or a very long time. Uh, a few of the other th highlights that I thought were interesting was uh, Peter talked about how having a controlling interest is overrated. He talked about, you know, people think that's uh, kind of going to solve problems in the future. But he pointed out if you've got problems, you've got problems. And it doesn't matter if you own 60 percent or 40 percent. Uh, the problems are still there. Um, and then lastly, uh, Peter talked about what he saw as the limiters of growth on uh, kind of middle market companies. And, you know, what he really emphasized was that the limiters, uh, for the most part, do not uh, revolve around capital. Uh, capital is the biggest commodity out there, uh, but it's other things, you know, it's things like time and the ability to focus and execute on uh, different strategies and ideas. Those are the things that limit growth more than capital. Obviously, you need capital too. Um, but anyway, uh, I encourage you to check that out and uh, we'll post a link uh, to that transcript, which you can get on our resources page. Um, and I hope you enjoy it. This is Jack Duvall, CEO of Bantam Incorporated. Thank you for watching.